Hey guys, good day. You're highly welcome back to Ezinless Kitchen. You're very welcome back to my channel. Hope you had a wonderful um, celebration. I hope everything went well. I'm wishing each and every one of you a happy new year. You are welcome to 2020. You're highly welcome, yeah? So I wanna say very big thanks to my new subscribers. If you're new to my channel, you are highly welcome. And thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button. Thank you so much. Thank you for being part of my family. I truly appreciate. Thank you, a massive hug for you. Thank you so much. And to my old subscribers, you guys are amazing. Amazing. Thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos. Thank you so much for always making my channel a lively one. Yes, thank you so much. So I would like us to prepare a very mouth watering recipe, okay? So it's called a soon. Yes. So to prepare this recipe, you have you have two options. You have two methods, okay? Number one is oven grill. You can grill, you can grill your goat meat in the oven or you can grill that using your grill machine that is um, in outdoor um, grill machine okay so on today's episode I'm going to be using my outdoor grill machine I would have loved to use my oven but guys I want to have that as soon taste like you know that main taste okay so that's it guys please if today's your first time of seeing my face please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell sign beside it that bell notifies you whenever i upload my videos okay so without wasting much of your time let me introduce you guys to our ingredients so we get started okay i love you bye bye so guys for this recipe we're going to be kneading our goat meat okay so I'm going to cut that later into tiny bits, okay? Here. The legs. So over here I have my scotch bonnet pepper. I have to reduce my light, excuse me. So over here I have my scotch bonnet pepper, my two garlic, and of course my ginger, okay? And I have my red bell pepper. If you love pepper a lot, you can please exclude this red bell pepper and use more of habanero peppers, okay? Yeah, you can use as much as you want. Yeah, so, but I'm gonna be using just, just one of this and one red bell pepper yeah so I have my onions my shredded onions so here I have my seasoning cubes I'm using no brand my curry crushed pepper my beef seasoning powder I have my salt in here and of course a little bit of vegetable oil okay so guys next I'll go ahead and start cutting the goat meat so let's go So I'm going to be cutting that into the sizes, okay? Not too small, not too big. I am done um, cutting the meat. Okay, this is it. So next I'm going to introduce my ingredients. I'm gonna add a little bit of curry. My beef seasoning powder. So I'm gonna be using just these two for now. Next I have to introduce my salt. A little bit of onions so guys I'm not adding any water to this yeah I'm not gonna be adding water so I just have to give it a very good stir we are not cooking soup we are making a soon so I don't need water so guys I covered my pot and I set my cooker on 14 to put on a medium to 
high heat okay so i'm going to be timing this yeah so i had to set my time to 25 minutes i don't want this um goat meat to overcook that's why i had to time it yeah so when it's done cooking i'm going to come back to you so guys did you see that did you see the water we didn't add any water to this so this is the water it's produced we don't need stock for this recipe okay so we have to leave it to continue cooking so we have six minutes left okay so after six minutes i'm going to bring it out i just want to show you guys the water it's produced this is it yes so we have to cover it again and let it continue cooking okay and we have one minute left okay so i have to transfer that right away you don't have to cook this for long like because we are still going to grill okay so guys this is what we got okay and this is the stock we got from that but i'm not going to be needing this stock for this recipe yeah next we are going to move over to our grilling position okay So guys, I moved my grill, um, my grill machine to my open place, yeah, where the smoke is going to be escaping from, yeah. So if I do this in my kitchen, everywhere is going to get smoky, yeah. So let me show you. So I opened my window for good ventilation. Okay, can you see the smoke? <laughs> yeah. So that's it. I didn't grill this outside because it's raining. See it? As, as you can see, they are grilling very well. Yeah. So we have to keep turning them. So in no time we're going to be taking them out okay so guys we are done grilling okay did you see that they are looking all brown yes yeah, so we are done grilling that's it oh guys that smells good already So I'm going to transfer that. So I'm going to transfer everything here. So next I have to introduce my vegetable oil. Just a little bit my garlic and ginger and of course my seasoning cube so next i'm going to introduce our grilled goat meat
little bit of water little bit of salt our crushed cayenne pepper here and there our onions shredded onions our pepper and of course the green bell pepper also okay so I'm gonna give everything a very good mix. Guys, this smells good. Oh my God. Oh my God. Wow. So I'm gonna cover that up. To cook for at least two minutes and we are so done guys. this is our asson oh my goodness guys this tastes so so yummy very delicious yeah so guys let me zoom in for you to see that very well okay guys we are done cooking this is our delicious mouth watering as soon yes you can have this with chilled cola chilled malt any drink of your choice yes so guys thank you so much for watching thank you for staying with me throughout this video i truly appreciate ya until i come your way next time remain blessed i love you bye bye